I feel like really what happened is that I scribed something that the Lord wanted written and I had no idea I was, as I was doing it the effect that it would have on people, but I knew it was having a great effect on me. But I want to back up just sort of say where, where it really started was when I was 14 years old, two things happened that year, I met two men. One was my golf professional, his name was Johnny Ariaga, and Johnny was one of the greatest uh, men that I've ever met in my life. He was a professional at, at our course, he was my teacher. And Johnny taught me to play the game from the mental side, um, which was very different than the technical teachers of today and the mechanics and the equipment. He really taught through parables, a lot like a guy named Harvey Pinnock. Um, he would, I remember every time that Johnny would hit a good golf shot, he would, and he was a great player, he would say the word Picasso. And one day I asked him on a par three after he hit this great shot up there by the hole, Johnny, what do you mean Picasso? And he said, oh, Cookie, you gotta understand something. He said, every time you walk up to the tee, you, you have a blank canvas in front of you and, and you've got to paint the picture before you ever pull the club and hit the shot. So you got to get up there and decide what you're going to do with it and you got to see it very vividly and clearly then take your club and then produce it. He said, whenever I hit a great shot, all I'm doing is signing the painting that, uh, that I created in my mind. That was one of the guys I met that summer that had a profound effect on me in my life in terms of where I was going in my golf career and how I was going to play golf, and how I was going to spend my life looking at golf differently than anybody else, and that is from the mental side, from how to, how to create success from the inside, and how to, how to really be able to paint shots, to see shots, to feel, and to trust, the SFT that we talk about in the book.